Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will learn about types of machine learning. Machine learnings are subcategorized into three basic parts. One is supervised learning, second is unsupervised learning, and the third is reinforcement learning. Now let's discuss each of them in details and understand when to use these models. Supervised learning uses labeled data to train machine learning models. So now the question arises, what is labeled data? Labeled data means that the output is already known to the user. The machine learning model needs to train and map the inputs to the outputs. To understand it better, let's take an example. We want to train the machine learning model to identify different shapes of objects, for example circle, square, etc. The user knows the end result, but the machine learning model is fed with all types of images to understand and filter the shapes. After this training, when new figure is introduced to machine learning model, it will be able to identify the image. Unsupervised learning uses unlabeled data to train machine learning model. When we say unlabeled data, it means that there is no fixed output variable. The model learns from the data, analyzes and discovers features and patterns in data and after that returns the result. Unsupervised learning are used in various applications such as NLP, natural language processing, image, voice and video recognition, anomaly detection, customer segmentation and recommendation engines. We will understand it better with an example. The model is fed with details of multiple animals, for example cat, dog, cow, etc. Features of the animals such as ears, speech, legs, body type, etc. will be analyzed for all the animals fed to the model. Now the model has analyzed the features of these animals and when we provide the machine learning model with any animal, it will compare the features and then come to a conclusion that it fit as a cat, dog, cow or not. For example, if the animal moves and has four legs and can give milk, the machine learning model will know it's a cow. Reinforcement learning trains a machine to take suitable access and maximize rewards in a particular situation. This optimal behavior is learned through interactions with the environment and observations of how it responds similar to children exploring the world around them and learning the actions that helps them achieve a goal. The applications like predictive text, text summarization, questions and answering, and machine translations are some examples where reinforcement learning are used in real world. By definition of supervised and unsupervised learning, we can understand difference between both machine learning models. Let's see below how supervised learning and reinforcement learning are different from each other. Reinforcement learning is all about making decisions sequentially. In simple words, we can say that the output depends on the state of the current input and the next input depends on the output of the previous step. Whereas supervised learning, the decision is made on the initial input or the input given at the start. In reinforcement learning, the decisions are independent. So we give labels to sequences of dependent decisions. Whereas in supervised learning, the decisions are independent of each other. So the labels are given to each decisions. Some examples of reinforcement learnings are like chess game, test summarization, etc. And the examples of supervised learning are like object recognition, spam detection, etc. Now we will see what are the type of machine algorithms used in each of the above types of machine learning models. Under supervised learning, linear regression, logistic regression, support vector machines, K nearest neighbor, decision tree, random forest, etc. are used. Under unsupervised learning, K means clustering, hierarchical clustering, DB scan, principal component analysis, etc. are used. Under reinforcement learning, Q learning, SARSA, Monte Carlo, 
deep Q network algorithms are used. Choosing the right algorithm and right type of machine learning models depends on what problems are we looking to solve. In this video, we saw different types of machine learning models and different type of machine learning algorithms used in each of machine learning models. In upcoming videos, we will see in details regarding machine learning algorithms used and their practical implementation. If you like this video, stay tuned for my next tutorial and yes, don't forget to hit the bell icon and subscribe yourself to our channel. If you have any comments or confusion, feel free to reach out through comment section. Thank you, have a nice day and stay tuned.